Good morning. Hello. You can't come to the Lake District without coming to the Pencil Museum, can you, Emily? Yes, that's a museum of, of pencils. I'm so excited. I love stationery. And presumably we're going to learn about all the different types of pencils. And the history of pencils. I'm excited. Are you excited? There's a surprisingly large car park for the Pencil Museum. I already love this place. It's already given us a pencil. Yeah, the ticket is a pencil. So it's four pound ninety-five to get in. Yeah, which includes adult. a pencil. You, get... <laughs> you also get a quiz on a clipboard, and you fill it in. And apparently, there's a prize at the end. <laughs> Stick around to see what the prize is, folks. You think we're going to win it? Of course, we're going to win it. Well, you live and learn, don't you? You didn't know that. Yeah, but Em, <laughs> did you hear the one about the broken pencil? No. I won't tell it to you, it's pointless. Um. They have a spy pencil. It was used during the war. It had a map rolled up in the pencil and a tiny little compass and it all screwed together beautifully and it looked like a normal pencil. And there's more to pencils than meets the eye, clearly. This is a pencil sharpener collection donated by a collector who's been collecting it for 50 years. Well, if you've got a room full of pencils, you need lots of pencils out there. Logic. Obviously, the uh, world's largest pencil is one of the star attractions, isn't it, Emily? Yes, it's nearly eight metres long. It nearly fills this hall, isn't it? <laughs> this big. This is big. And it's yellow, and you couldn't write with it. No, not easily. I wonder why they chose a yellow one. Hmm, all the colours. I'd have gone for red or something. Yeah. So, Emily. Yes, Bob. How many pencils are manufactured every year? Billions. It is billions. 14 billion. If you lined them up, you'd go around the world 62 times. So, some very clever and patient people sculpt the lead on the end of a pencil, and there's some on display. How did the mathematician cure his constipation? Well, he worked it out with a pencil. Uh, oh. Emily, we've had our prize, haven't we, for the quiz? We got some colour and pencils. Look at the excitement in this place. Can I get my colouring book then? No. Yes, we are now, of course, in the gift shop, as is tradition. And Emily, as always, you can have one thing. Mm. What's your one thing then? Pussycat colouring book. Bought yourself a pussycat colouring book. <laughs> did you enjoy the pencil museum? I actually really did. Very interesting. Very I found out about it. World War II pencils. I saw the world's largest pencil, which is a lot bigger than I thought. I know more than I ever need to know about pencils. If I was ever in a quiz where there was a question about a pencil, I'd know the answer. <laughs> Who'd have thought there was so much interesting stuff to learn about pencils, eh? I'd never have guessed. We would recommend it, wouldn't we, guys? <laughs> There's a surprise. Yeah. We're going to go back to our holiday now. Thanks for watching. Bye. If you like this video, click on subscribe and hit the bell icon to receive notifications. If you want us to do a review for you, just click on the About section below and contact us.